Hey guys, what's going on? To tell you a little bit about the sunscreen I've been using on my face for this summer. So I actually went to aesthetic school, have a license in aesthetics, and when I was in school they really played into us how important sunscreen is. And with all the risks of melanoma and skin cancer that are out there these days, I really just try to protect myself. I'm guilty of going and tanning when I was younger and stuff like that. And now that I'm 28, I just really try to do what's right for my skin. And I also make my husband wear it. So this is Copper Tone Sunscreen, which has been around forever. You could see like the logo. I'm sure like you guys recognize a little girl with the dog. This is the sensitive skin faces. So I do have a bit of sensitive skin, not on my face. Face. I don't have eczema, but I do have eczema breakouts that I'll get on my legs and stuff and Just the most random things will be sensitive to my skin and make me break out So I try to do my best to always keep my skin protected from the Sun and other elements and stuff like that people don't realize that Even when you have makeup on and even when it's winter the Sun's rays can still affect your skin Maybe they're not going to give you a burn, but they could definitely lead to melanoma skin cancer Cancerous moles and stuff like that and I think people don't realize that especially in the cold winter, but Every day like especially now when I go to the beach. I try to put on SPF 50 so this is a hypoallergenic fragrance free lotion So it doesn't have a smell to it, which is fine it won't clog pores or cause breakouts. It doesn't, and I know because I'm very sensitive and it hasn't made me break out or have any weird reaction to my skin. It is water resistant for 80 minutes. So if you're like in the water for 80 minutes, like an hour and a half or whatever the case is, you'll have to just reapply it afterwards. 50, which is really great. Broad spectrum SPF 50. I purchased the two floral ounces, but you guys could also get it in a bigger size as well. <clears throat> I think it comes in like a five ounce also, maybe even bigger. It's made with naturally sourced zinc oxide. Drug facts, active ingredients, octanexate, 7.5%, zinc oxide. For uses, helps prevent sun uh, sunburn. If used as directed with other sun protection measures, decreases the risk of skin cancer and early skin aging caused by the sun. Uh, warnings for external use only. Do not use on damaged or broken skin, like if you've cut or anything like that. It could make it worse for you. When using this product, keep out of eyes and rinse with water to remove. Stop use and ask doctor if rash occurs. <clears throat> so this is like a really thick consistency so it, it kind of like takes a while to rub in I'll show you guys oh, I just use it at the beach Friday so it's like a little bit sandy in there probably shake before using but really white just how like sunscreen's supposed to be and this is me like rubbing it in so you really have to like get in there and just rub it in your skin and this is like I fully rubbed it in it, it doesn't feel greasy, but it definitely, you know, your skin is going to be like, it, it moisturizes, which is nice. You know, you could definitely like feel it on your skin. Like it just feels like you have a lotion on. Literally no scent. I'm like smelling it right now. It does not smell like anything, which is fine. I mean, a lot of times when there's fragrance, it's made with like chemicals and like fake smelling stuff. So this does not have that at all. So could uh, peel the label to see the drug facts. Okay, I just peeled the label so you guys could see. So directions, shake well before use, apply liberally 15 minutes before sun exposure so it sits in your skin. Reapply after 80 minutes of swimming or sweating, immediately after towel drying, and at least every two hours. Sun protection measures, spending time in the sun increases your risk of skin cancer and early aging, of course. To decrease this risk, use, regularly use a sunscreen with a bo uh, broad spectrum SPF value of 15 or higher and other sun protection measures including limit time in the sun, especially from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Wear long sleeve shirts, pants, hats, and sunglasses. Children under 6 months, ask a doctor. Other information, protect this product from excessive heat and direct sun. May stain or damage some uh, fabrics or surfaces. So 
I haven't had that happen, but usually like after I use it, I'm done with the beach, being in the sun, whatever, I'm usually popping right in the shower afterwards. And then they have the inactive ingredients listed here. So yeah, just I guess if you have it with you at the beach and it's hot out, maybe try to put it in the shade or like wrap it in a towel and put it in your bag just so it's not in the direct sunlight getting heated. I guess that could kind of ruin the product a little bit. So just be careful with that. But overall, really great product. SPF 50, I think that's maybe the highest it could go for sensitive skin, copper tone for your face. I hope you guys try it out this summer and love it. Thanks for watching, guys.